Good morning. Good morning. It's currently 3.58 a.m. <laughs> on a Monday. Let's start the day. First-line treatment with generalized seizures. Uh, um, or sodium Well, one of those, I yeah, think. One of those. <laughs> I'll say Okay, let's see. It's sodium valparate, um, but carbamazepine first-line for focal seizures, so it's not bad at all. Nice. Here at the hospital right now. What time is it right now, lovey? 7.23 a.m. in the morning and this is the hospital. Hi, Caleb. How are you feeling about your first day back at medical school as a fourth year? Apprehensive, but I'm sure it'll be fine once we get back into the swing of things. What about you, Pete? How do you feel? I'm very excited to be back. Had a great summer and I'm ready to go. I'm excited to get back into a routine and feel like I have something to do. <laughs> um, I'm feeling a bit tired, but it should be good. It should be good. Yeah. Thank you. Basically. Currently, we're just waiting for our placement to start. Yes, it's very nice angle. So I'm too embarrassed to like put it all up. And we're just waiting for our placement to start. What time is it? 15. It's 08.45, yeah. so yeah, 15 minutes left. I'll keep you guys updated. This is the room that we're going to be in. We're just waiting for the doctor to arrive right now. Morning, Caleb. Morning was good. Had some good teaching. Um, was very hungry, so happy to be on lunch. Good morning. Really interesting teaching with the diabetic nurse. Learned a lot about insulin and all of that. That was interesting. Different people and uh,
I just went to the toilet, but now I can't find my way back to the library. One of the fifth years helped me find my way to the toilet anyway, and now I can't get back to the library. Hiya. Hey, sorry. Do you know the way to the... Hi, sorry. sorry. Do you know the way to the library? I do, yes. It's probably quicker down this way. That way, thank you. Okay, I need to be more professional. Caleb, how was your day? Day was good. A bit chaotic being in the first day. Um, it seems like the hospital isn't used to the amount of students, but I'm sure they'll get accustomed to it and so will we. Yeah, exactly. You're more hopeful on the camera than you are. Right? Off camera, that is accurate, yeah. 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 <laughs> Why? Why are you telling the people? Each employer could be watching, who knows? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, do you want to meet up? Bye. How was your day, Russella? Your first day back at med school? Finding my way around a new hospital was a bit tricky at first, but I had my partners to go with, so that was quite nice. Home, and now we're going to Lidl to do some shopping, and I'll see you guys there. And she was like going into so much detail about anatomy and stuff. Not showing off her knowledge, but like kind of showing off her knowledge. Mm. I was like, oh, okay, cool. I oh, she? Someone else wants it. <laughs> Just... I forgot what I need. <laughs> what I need milk. What do you need? Hello. Hi, Rob. Following me. Oh my god, I didn't even know it was you. If you ask me, <laughs> literally on the same table, but if I sit there, I would not be able to see because of all the crap in between. There is a lot of crap. Caleb was so, so good. good. My new placement partner is like the best person me. ever. Hey, what like, are you? He's so comfortable with. Not your placement partner. 
Yeah, of course, all of you are. Hello, it's currently 8.42. I've had such a long day, but I think it was a good first day back at medical school. So we had an endocrinology clinic in the morning. I got to see patients with different hormone related problems like thyroid hormone diseases or adrenaline hormone diseases. And I got to examine a patient with a goiter, which is like very big swelling neck. Her thyroid gland, which is the gland that sits on your neck was very swollen. And examining her was very helpful for my learning. In the afternoon though we didn't have any clinic so I was just in the library doing practice questions for my upcoming exam. But the worst thing about having to commute three hours a day for my hospital placements is the fact that I come home so late and I don't have any energy or time to do any work before I go to sleep and that is the situation I'm in right now. I'm just gonna go do my skincare and get ready for bed. If I feel awake enough then I might do some work but I'm not gonna force myself because we'll need to be driving at 6am tomorrow morning as well. So let's see how I feel. Okay, in the end, I did some practice questions on endocrinology for like half an hour, but I hope you guys enjoyed my first day back at medical school. If you did, consider subscribing and liking this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.